Hello and welcome to Local Edition. I'm Leslie Layton. In Ontario, the focus is going downtown. The mayor's here, Paul Leon, to talk about uh, what the projects are, what's going on over there. Hi, Paul. Hi, Leslie. Great to be with you again. Thanks for being here. Um, you have a, a downtown. You're focusing on downtown. Right. And downtown as a destination. Right. Well, I think that uh, you look at some cities and they do have a great downtown. And the city of Ontario historically has had a downtown that's been in, in transition, shall we say. Um, during the 60s when a lot of the, the big stores, the J.C. Penney's, the, the Pet Boys and all of the other types of stores that used to build the old style downtown moved to the mall, it uh, left a big hole in the city of Ontario as far as our downtown went. And, and so there was a, a decades of decay. And we're in the process right now of rebuilding. Mm -hmm. I, I think that uh, the whole socialization changes. You know, we have, we have Walmarts and big box stores that take the place of a downtown. So you have to really focus on creating that sort of experience. Yes, and uh, we're doing that right now. In fact, we have many projects going on to the, rebuild our downtown. Uh -huh. So tell us about them, the, the town square area. Well, uh, we have the Ontario Town Square Project, which is a, a, a great central gathering place for the city. Mm -hmm. So what, uh, what do people get out of it in the downtown town square? Well, what we're trying to do is attract people to downtown again so that businesses can feel secure that when they open up that they'll be able to sustain that business. Um, what a lot of people don't understand about city government and the powers that a city have, has uh, they think that you can just determine what shops go where. So we can say, well, there are these shops, and we want a, um, a Starbucks there, and we want a Jamba Juice there, and we want to maybe bring a, um, uh, another nice store right here, and, and that we as a city uh, government or the city council determine those things. But that isn't what determines it. What determines it is the, is the business community and also the demographics. Yeah, so how do you attract those businesses to the area? Well, you create a synergy in the, in the community by bringing amenities that are people attractions like this uh, Ontario downtown uh, what square are, project. Like, what are the arts and cultural amenities that people can go to downtown as the destination and enjoy? Well, that's a great question. I'm glad, you, glad that you asked because we have a downtown arts uh, colony which is awesome. I was there recently and I couldn't believe the, the different, the lofts, you know, the people that live downstairs, or they live upstairs and their art uh, is downstairs. And then uh, on uh, certain nights of the week, they're, they're open to the public to come and to enjoy the art. And then straight across the street on Euclid, we also have the, the museum, uh, the Ontario Museum. Then we also have the Museum of Art. And then, of course, with this uh, downtown uh, square project that we're doing, which will be the gathering place. So we have a, an amphitheater and uh, a, a lot of uh, a children's play garden, a clock tower, a band shell, all of these things to bring life back to downtown. You know, it seems that people are ready for this, too, because we're all isolated behind our phones and our computers, and we want to get together with people and, and enjoy that sort of thing together. Um, you know, just uh, about 30 seconds left. Tell us, though, quickly about the state of the city. How are you doing? Well, we believe that the city of Ontario is the poster child for how to do things right. But I will say this, I say this every year, our state of the city is not your father's state of the city. It's not your grandfather's state of the city. The city of Ontario does a state of the city like you've never seen. It is flash, bang, pow, and more. And what do we need to do if we want to see this? Well, you uh, call it, contact the city through the website, and you can uh, order your tickets to be there and be a part of it. Okay. All right. Thank you very much, Mayor Paulion, for being here. Thank you. Glad you were here, too. I'm Leslie Layton.